Howdy there guys, this is TechSwerb and in this video I'm going to be reviewing the Orki 6 port USB charging station. Now this particular charging station has 6 ports in total, 2 of which at the bottom are USB Type-C and have Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0 and then the charging ports above it are USB Type-A and have Orki's AI power which basically means it's going to automatically try and detect the fastest current and voltage that your device can take and supply it with that so in, in essence it should um, within certain limitations be able to charge your device as quickly as possible versus not having this technology basically okay so in this video i'm just going to list a few things that i like about the device and then i'm going to list a few things that i don't like about the device and then i'm going to end the video by sort of summarizing everything and tell you basically if i think this is worth picking up so first of all the device is very lightweight i think that's a good thing but it could be a double-edged sword as well and i'll move on to, and i'll talk about that a bit more um, in a moment but yeah it's extremely lightweight it's extremely small um very very compact and very portable i actually used this on the train the other day um uh, another nice thing is every single port in this device can be used simultaneously um so it, it's not going to explode or anything if you plug in you know if you if you use all the ports basically you, you can use all the ports basically and the and the device instructions manual specifies that you know you're capable of doing this um because there might be some misconceptions out there thinking that you can't actually use all of them at the same time but no that's incorrect you can use all of them at the same time and um, the the device works splendidly you plug it into mains and th and that's how it receives its power so I've, I've, I've used the USB Type-C ports and they work fine. Um, however, onto the negative sides of the device, um, it's very scratch prone. And I can actually see, you probably won't be able to see this on the camera, so I'm not gonna bother actually showing this, but you, there's a very distinct scratch and I'm not pleased with that. It's, it's very prone to scratching. And the Surface Dock for the Surface Pro 4 is the same and i don't you know i don't like that about such devices because they're meant to be portable so they need to withstand ruggedness and sort of beating about your bag and things like that another thing as well um a bit of a negative i know i sort of said this is a positive but the light the overly lightweight nature of the device um means that it doesn't anchor um what you've tethered to it so for example with the surface pro 4's um surface dock it was heavy for the reason that if as you plugged in more devices to the device and you for example tried to you know you're using your phone and you try to just tug it slightly it wouldn't move but i'm just going to demonstrate now you can you can see that just a very slight tug actually moves the device and i think that's a very concerning feature Okay, so to round up, I think the Orgy 6 port charging station is a fantastic product. It's very portable, albeit it's, it's overly light, too light that it doesn't really anchor any devices to it. So it's, it's easily, you know, it, you can tug it quite easily whilst uh, trying to operate uh, more than one device with it, as well as charge it at the same time. But I guess if, you know, you intend to use it whilst I guess completely stationary without interacting with the, the, the devices tethered to it then that that won't be an issue with you and I do I would highly recommend this product at the time of filming this video um, I believe the product is around eight, uh, 18 or 19 pounds on Amazon I'll put a description I'll put a link in the description um, t to the direct link that I actually purchased this from um, it's amazon.co.uk and you'll find that below um, but yeah, that, that pretty much does it for this video. Um, if you haven't seen the unboxing video, I did make an unboxing video. And once again, I'll pop that in the description below. Um, so you can check that out if you haven't already. If you did, if you did like this video, please give us a like. If you disliked it, um, certainly just give us a thumbs down. And if you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing to my channel. And on that note, I will see you in the next video.